Hi, today we're going to see how to convert images to outlines in GIMP. I will put the link of this image in the description box. Make sure the image you're going to use has a black outline around it to make this method work. So now I'm going to increase the canvas size. So go to image, canvas size, and now click on the chain icon here to link the width and the height. And here we can do calculations. So I'm going to press the plus. So click on the width first and then click plus here. And then I'm going to increase the width and the height by 10%. And then I'm going to type 10% here and then press enter. So here it is. And now click on the center here to center the layer on the Canva and then resize. And now create a new transparent layer. So click on this icon here, fill it with transparency and then press OK. And now place the transparent layer under the cartoon layer here, this one here, and then fill it with white. Here, I'm just going to drag the foreground color. And now I'm going to merge down these two layers here. So click on the top layer, and then click on this icon here to merge down the layer. And now I'm going to duplicate this layer here to see the before and after. So we'll duplicate it. And now I'm going to desaturate this layer. So go to colors desaturate and then desaturate here and now as you can see here there are many modes here make sure to choose the mode that, that has the lightest colors here so for example difference between the value hsv and the luminance so here choose the value since the since the gray hair is lighter here so and then press ok and now i'm going to duplicate this layer here click on this icon here so here it is and now change the layer mode to dodge, this one here. And as you can see here, it removed most of the gray color. So as you can see here, it removed most of the gray colors here. Just kept this one here since it's darker here. So I'm just going to duplicate it one more time. Click on this icon here. And as you can see, the layer is dodge here because we duplicated the previous layer. And now right click on the top layer and then new from visible. And now I'm going to remove these three layers here with the gray colors. So click on the top one and then click on the X icon here to delete it. And then second one and then the last one here. So now we have only the outline here and the colored image layer here, sorry. So let's click on the eye icon here to show the outline here. Select it. Now here, Sometimes you may find some gray color remaining. So in order to convert it to black here, so go to colors, threshold. This will convert all the colors here to black and white. I'm not going to change these settings. I'm going to leave them like this, so press OK. And now press the minus key on our keyboard to zoom out. So here's the before and the after. And now I'm going to sharpen the outlines here. So press the plus key on your keyboard to zoom in. I'm going to blur them. So go to filters, I'm going to blur this layer, blur, Gaussian blur. And now here I'm just going to blur it a little bit here. I'm going to blur it by 2.50 here. If you blur it too much, you won't be able to sharpen it. So just I'm going to click on reset here. I'm, ju I'm just going to blur it 2.5 here and then press OK. And now go to colors and then curves. And here I'm going to drag the white slider here to the left and the black slider to the right here to increase the black and white colors here and to sharpen the layer here. So I'm going to increase the black color here like this. So as you can see, it increased the color, the black color. And now I'm going to increase the, I'm going to move the white slider to the left here. So here I'm going to move the right one here and then just here until you find the best result here. Now click on the GIMP window here and then press the minus key on your keyboard to zoom out to see the effect here. Now I'm going to adjust it here. So I'm just going to drag the black color here like this. Let's see the before and after by clicking on the preview. So here. So now I'm going to leave it like this, so press OK. And now by clicking on the eye icon here, we can see the before and the after, so here. So I think that's it. That's how we can convert images into outlines in GIMP. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day and uh, till next time.